prospect, James, that VP could exit a major, you know, like zero three in the group stage. That is that is just so it's sad, isn't it? Just, you know, being present throughout their history in CSGO. It's just, uh, we, we've seen a decline or just, you know, bumpy ride. You can't stop me. Skadaddy! Get be the Molotov forcing anyone away from swinging wide. Grabs a second kill. Great, and a third one! Skadoodle, what a recovery and a hold! All four kills for Skadoodle. He shuts everything down from Liquid. And with that, that's basically going to put an end to everything Team Liquid would throw at them. Trying to get out of Palace, but he's being sprayed through the smoke by the CT. Speaking of which, MSL doesn't feel confident to stop the bomb plant from going down, but the success is being had anyway. Skadoodle now, last man, one versus four. They know where he is, but can they kill him? Almost a headshot, but not quite. Config goes one by one. There's so many of them, but they're picking one at a time. Skadoodle with a lovely fast shot. How is this happening? It's down to one on one. The odds are ridiculous. This is impossible. But Magix is coming in from the back. Skadoodle seems to know. Really pull this off. Apparently not. Ethan's had enough of it. He has another kill out of his last round that saved them. Good shot. Skadoodle playing it for him, but he's faced down by two. Backs off, he's got room to work with. He's backed off far enough. Skadoodle, of all people, the unlikely hero in the situation, has held off the bomb. He's just got to play the time. No scope misses. Crumbles. It almost felt unnecessary, right? Like, they they had strong sight holds. They had uh, they had automatic as the float. They had two people in that A bomb site. They had two people in the B bomb site. You would have had three at any site once the attack had come in. I think uh, it's just the underlying issue of Cloud9 seeming very uncomfortable on the CT side. Yeah. And they have to go for a place somewhere, right? Oh, Ooh. look at this Skadoodle doing his best simple impression with the dropping kill and actually chops the smoke. Lures one out, he gets another. That's four kills for Skadoodle. He's tapped the bomb. Is Henny gonna push forward? He has plenty of time for this Skadoodle oh. though. He misses the shot. Now he's gonna get on the bomb. I think he's just gonna stick it. Henny, he's got a Glock. He's got and it. And he can't fight it. The he's knife coming it. in and he's got it. Skadoodle. Skadoodle is a hero. What are you doing? This is an FBL. Uh, it, was, it was actually really close. Uh, you won in double overtime in the last map. So, hi, Stewie. <laughs> double overtime in the last map. But why do you think it was different this time and it was so convincing? Is it a uh, difference in your guys' play style? Are you guys just better now or what's up? Uh, I'll be completely honest, we didn't expect to play train. We were... Thankfully spot Shroud sooner than Shroud could approach and pounce. Good shot from Skadoodle, but round over, I'm afraid. Big's gonna make this 10. One or they? will they? Because he's now picked up a gun. He's got armor to work with. Smoke's gonna bounce the wrong way, but he's hit the high HP player. Keeve down. Skadoodle's got something in this. He's got an argument in the say. A say in the argument, perhaps. As God be 16 HP goes hunting, he's looked the wrong way. This is all Skadoodles. This is all oh, timing. Skadoodles to lose. Bomb is in the hands of God B. Now the fact that he's made it the drop room, he likely expects that Skadoodle. <gasps> he's wrapped back around. God oh. B misses the shot. Skadoodle with four grenades to clear him out. So if he gets the timing down right and just kills the guy defusing in the last couple of seconds, this can actually end up working. Currently spotting it out. He doesn't want to jump the gun. They've only tabbed it once. This is incredibly sneaky from Skadoodle. Now he's going to be walking forward. A couple of seconds left. He goes for the shot and it's a headshot. And Cello is down. Oh no. Skadoodle has got no heart at all. He gets the last kill as well. Steals the round from Pain Gaming. Unbelievable. Would you look at it's that? It's also got a frag in the meantime. They're running out of players on the Cloud9 side. And now it's all Skadoodle. They're oh. defusing. But he dabs the one person holding the kit. Skadoodle going more. Headshot coming in. And Skadoodle is going to get and every single one, the quad kill happens and Cloud9 wins the round. He has been insane this whole event at those situations where you would always, in the past, rule him out. And he's gone with weapons that, you know, should never win in situations, winning 1v4s, 1v4. There's the peak from Happy. Oh, the adjustment! Skadoodle turns it into a one-on-one. -on -one. He's able to turn it around. 9 HP and Happy Misses that kill and puts RPK into such a tough spot. And this is patience. The time is low. Seven seconds, five seconds. Searching for the kill and Skadoodle just hiding. Here's the footsteps and he's trying to buy the time and he does it. Skadoodle, that is an incredible performance and another botched opportunity for Envious. Even Skadoodle with that AWP is forced back, but he has legged Apex. So some damage has been done and there's the nade cleanup from Rush. Oh, they're very close right now. That smoke is timely. Make sure they don't easily get shut down. NBK's gone, and Skadoodle is just... He's really feeling it right now. Which was one of the key points made. Oh, and it threw the smoke! Next miss a single shot. Guardian waits patiently as Cloud9 sets the push up. Oh! Oh, this happens! They made it work! Cloud9 are your e-league mates!
Major Champions! They were a heavy underdog, but they did it for North America. Skadoodles won the Major! Of your mind, coming into the playoffs, there were some doubters. They thought maybe you wouldn't be able to perform, but you proved them wrong. Skadaddy showed up. What do you have to say to all the haters? <laughs> Uh, you know, I came out to play, you know, I don't really, uh, it was the finals and uh, no regrets, you know, I'm, I'm out there, I'm out there. Last but not least, there are so many Cloud9 fans here in the Aganis Arena, so many Cloud9 fans all over the world. What do you have to say to them? Uh, first, I want to give a shout out to, um, you know, my friends personally who came out to support me. Uh, Tarek Swamey came out as well. Um, our CEO came to see us win, which is really, really nice. Um, and uh, thank you for all the fans who uh, showed up. <laughs> Sorry. Congratulations, Skadoodle. Once again, your E-League Major Champion is Cloud9! There you have it. I'll tell you what, many a manly tear has been shed.